But I, no, I realized something. I was focused on the negative of my whole life, right? I was always upset, always frustrated, because I was always looking at what I didn't do, or what I couldn't do, or what they couldn't do, what they didn't do, or what they should do. But not anymore, not anymore. Now I'm just looking at what I can do, right? Because look what I can do. Look at that. I, I'm the boss of my body. Look at that. Why the heck we don't wake up every morning, get out of bed, and think, holy cow, look at this. It's all working. Thank you, Jesus. I can put my left foot in and my left foot out. Right? And you know what? That's what it's all about. <laughs> <laughs> we could live with so much more freedom, right? Right, have fun, right? We could wake up every day and give ourselves a new walk. Wouldn't that be fun? You go to work, hey, Jim, how's it going? <laughs> it's me, Paul. <laughs> right, every day, you got the boss telling you what to do, right? Well, maybe he didn't tell you how to do it. Right, sure, I'll get that for you, Mr. Boss Man. Might take a while. Today I'm a sea turtle. <laughs> the journey, not the destination. <laughs> yeah, but I try to stay positive. Right, know what I've been doing lately? My motto and my affirmation, I want to find good news in everything. Because you can. What you focus on grows. I want to find good news in everything. Uh, like for instance, for instance, uh, uh, about six months ago I had my license revoked. Yeah, unpaid tickets in the 80s. Right? But here's the good news. Here's the good news. I just saved a bundle on my car insurance. <laughs> There's good news in everything, I'm telling you. I just found out I have bed bugs. Hey, no, here's the good news. My in-laws only stay for one night. <laughs> Right? There's good news in everything, right? If you're over 50, all the music you love is in the dollar bin. <laughs> right? Yeah. <laughs> when I sit, my, if I sit for more than 20 minutes, my back goes out. Right? The good news, every 15 minutes, I have to get up to pee. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's good news in everything. I try to be positive, but you know what? My first thought is always negative. Right? I always think the worst, and then I make the best out of that. Right? Yeah, anyone else do that? Right, right? Yeah, I'm like a paranoid optimist. Right? It's the Murphy's Law of spirituality. Right? Anything that can go wrong will go wrong. But it's all for the best. <laughs> right? But like as a kid, as a kid, the only way I was able to get to sleep was convincing myself that the monster under my bed could beat the crap out of the boogeyman in the closet. <laughs> but to this day, right, it's all, that's the way my mind works, right? If I get a headache within 10 minutes, oh no. Oh, that's a tumor, that's a tumor. Just when my life starts taking off, I get a tumor. I convince myself I have a tumor. Then I say, Paul, well, hold on, maybe, you know, maybe it's a tumor. Maybe you might be the first one that gets a good tumor. Right, they discovered good cholesterol, good fat. They might discover, right, doctor's gonna be like, Mr. Lyons, we can't believe it. Your tumor burns fat and builds muscle. <laughs> In two weeks, you'll be fit as a fiddle. <laughs> right, and then I start thinking, wow, they're gonna name the tumor after me. I could have a famous tumor. There's Lou Gehrig's disease, right? Doctor's gonna be like, sir, you got Paul Lyons' tumor. What's that? It's an abnormal growth in consciousness. <laughs> You're gonna find good news in everything. But doc, what about these heart palpitations? Why, that's opportunity knocking. <laughs> Wait to meet the nurse that works at the defibrillator. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah.